good morning, evening or afternoon, depending on when you're watching and where you're watching from. We're back down the beach after uh, a few weeks off. Just done like uh, over a year of uploading every weekend. Weather was a bit atrocious and the hunt hadn't been that good, so we decided not to make a video because, you know, don't want to make them and they're not very interesting. So uh, yeah, took a few weeks off and it's been lovely. Done a few bits at home and yeah, so it's been nice. So hope you're all keeping well. Uh, my first find was this beautiful bit of green sea glass and my second find is this which I'm pretty sure looks like a bit of mammoth tusk Whoa, look at that That certainly is you can see all the layers in it there oh, What a beautiful looking piece Reach off of that Give it a bit of a desand and uh, you'll see it in the roundup So hopefully we'll find some more bits I'll see you on the next clip Guess who's back, 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 back again. Curry's back. This would have been a cool find, but unfortunately it's pro call me. Bit of a lobster claw. Obviously we're in the fishing game here in winter. So quite popular to them if you catch lobster and stuff. But yeah, unfortunately it just broke on me, damn it. <laughs> Next find, I've spotted this little bit of uh, aluminium. It's like a bit of the aircraft. So that sort of material, that sort of thickness, could well be, but without any rivet holes, I can't be sure. But I will take it home and give it a clean up. So you'll see that in the roundup. So uh, a lovely bit of blue or whatever it is, sea glass. I've just spotted a vellum knight, which is over here. Which I'll just quickly grab. That's quite a chunky one. Nice. And I've just spotted a bit of bow. Well, I think it is anyway. Yes. A little slither of bone. Beautiful. Thought it was going to be a bit of a rubbish day today, but uh, that's not too bad. A nice little handful of finds. Can you see my friend? Lovely bit of bone. First bit of the day. Just spotted this lovely piece of bone. It's the bone marrow side. Lovely there. Nice piece. No, not that kind of bone. Just spotted this little beauty, which I think is a little bit of bone. Yep, that's a little bit of bone. Found a few little bits today, it's not too bad. Thought it was going to be absolutely rubbish, but the beach does surprise me. Fantastic. Well, Kerry's just been looking at this bit and she's totally missed it. Oh well, your loss. That was a bit of bone. And we're back at Bottles and Blizzards HQ. Went a bad little hunt today. That's uh, currently June and we've still got the heating on because the weather is absolutely awful. So in no particular order, got a nice big chunk on it. That's going to go to uh, Richie. He's got a little project for that. Uh, some sort of, I think that's like crab lines. So that'll probably be repurposed. I'll tie some plants and things up for that. Uh, got another bit of rubbish there. A few other little bits. Uh, this is Kerry's little hoard. She's got, she found another bit of this the other week. This is um, the base of one of them old um, onion or mallet bottles. You can see how old it is. Look at the glass. Like hand blown, super thin. Absolutely fantastic find. Be nice to find the neck of it. But yeah, nice. So she found uh, two bits of it now. 
There's another bit she found the other week. It's a bit of a punt of an old bottle, so that would have been that way up, poking up uh, inside the bottle from the base. Another cool little find. Don't know what we'll do with that, but cool little find. Just got the obligatory lighter, always seem to find one of them. Uh, a couple of bellum nights or bits of one. Uh, nice hagstone, that'll look nice on a key ring. Quite an interesting uh, bit of flint with a hole in it. A little bottle, I don't know if there's an old camera cartridge one or an old um, medicine or pill bottle maybe. Uh, various bits of rubbish. Uh, some bits of tile and a bit of bone. I think that's just a red bit of plastic. Thought that could be a bit of uh, red sea glass, but uh, sounds very plasticky. So I'll just go in the bin. Um, on some of my finds, I've uh, got a bit of this, don't know if that's an uh, aircraft or just a bit of aluminium, but uh, I'll give it a bit of a clean up, might be some numbers on it somewhere, who knows. I'll have to have a look. Got a bit of coal, some of these sort of green looking stones. Uh, got a bit of Canelian or agate or whatever it is. Lovely. I always get drawn to these because uh, you never know when it's going to be a bit of amber. But that is uh, definitely not a bit of amber. Uh, got a few bits of sea glass. Got that big old bellum night. Got that other bit there. This is actually the bottom half of one. And this is the uh, fragma cone here, this little darker bit. Very interesting. I've got another bit of aluminium, I don't know if it's off the um, airplane or what, it's just a little bit of aluminium. Looks uh, to have some age to it because it's got some of that sort of black concretion on it. So that's quite interesting. I've uh, got a few bits of bone. That was my biggest bit. There's a bit of a uh, tusk, that's some of the outer bark layer I think. You can see all the layers of it there. Can't see any shrag lines in the end because it's very well worn. Can maybe just see a few there. Look, I've uh, got a few other little bits, including that little skinny bit. Uh, and that label, I don't know what that's got written on it. Fitted with a something or other disposal unit. And that's a beam of label. So, yeah, it weren't too bad this week. Nice to get back out. Um, hopefully we'll be back next week with a video, depends on how good the hunting is, and uh, yeah, hope you all have a lovely week, thanks for joining us again, we'll see you all soon, and take care of yourselves, see you later, take care.